First Alert Weather with Brian McCormick. A scary looking scene coming out of Poplar Bluff this evening. Check this out. A very dark clouds. You even see some scud rising. As a matter of fact, I'm very concerned about this. This actually looks like yeah, that's rotating. That's a funnel cloud guys right there in Poplar Bluff. That's certainly rotating. Uh, what we're going to do right now is go ahead and oh my goodness. Do you see that? That is certainly yeah, that's a torn. That's that's a funnel cloud. The temperature is 75 degrees. What we're going to do is go ahead and get right to the radar. This is what we are watching right now in Poplar Bluff in Central Butler County Highway 60 Highway 160 as well. What I'm going to go ahead and do is kind of zoom in on this. Now there is no official warning, but uh, that is a that is a rotating funnel cloud now. Now that is in Poplar Bluff and that is continuing to move off to the north and east. Now this is something that's developed within the last minute or so. I was talking with Molly and our cameraman Chris and uh, certainly looking rather scary. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is put on the velocity product and we're going to see if there's any rotation. Now it's very difficult to tell at this time uh, because this is very far from the radar site. Uh, what you see are these little shades of purple. Uh, that's aliasing or that's just really far from the radar site. So we're not getting a great image of what exactly is going on. But generally when you have the velocity product in here, you see you look for the green and you look for bright red. And you look for them very close together. Now any rotation will be very weak, very low top. So again, if you're listening in the Poplar Bluff, Northern Butler County, be on the lookout. We are still uh, dealing with the chance for a, a funnel cloud. Now what I'm going to go ahead and do now is kind of zoom back out and I want to see if I can get a uh, uh, Look at that sky cam once again. Now it looks like things are fairly quiet, but this is the area that I'm watching. What we see here is what we refer to as an SLC, a scary looking cloud. That's a big black cloud that we are watching, but I've seen some rotation right here. Now this is the hospital and uh, wow. I mean, they just had some very heavy rain in Poplar Bluff, so I'm going to continue to watch this very, very closely. Now, not only has it been rather active for parts of Poplar Bluff and the Heartland, but check out what's going on to our west. A very robust, very mature, well-developed low pressure system, just creating an awful lot of severe weather in the western Oklahoma, northern Texas and Kansas area. And you can see some showers and thunderstorms developing in that moist southerly flow. And uh, once again, zooming in to the other parts of the Heartland that are seeing rain, looks like uh, Corning down to Rector, Pigott, seeing some light showers and thunderstorms in eastern Clay County, followed by extreme southern portions of Dunklin County. Uh, Union City, O'Brien County hit very hard today by some heavy rain. Widespread reports of about two and a half to three and a half inches. Uh, we're